Hi everybody, this is Vincent Ng of MCNG Marketing, and today I have an awesome tool. It is made with awesome sauce. Um, if you've been trying to screen capture certain things on web pages or from Facebook and you wanna post them on Pinterest and you haven't found that right tool, this tool is simply amazing. So big thank you to Christina Mendoza and Ray for making this free tool. Um, so let's say that you need to capture something on Facebook. What you wanna be able to do is load up Firefox and visit the site www.pin, the number four ever.com and install it right over here. Once you've installed it, you'll get this toolbar. If you find the toolbar a little bit too big, you can click on the mini toolbar here and it will shrink it. But what I'm really interested in showing you is actually the power tool section. When I click on power tools, I'll notice that there's a camera here and it says pin anything. This is truly amazing. So I'm gonna go over to Facebook and I'm gonna go visit uh, marketer John Loomer. And so John Loomer, you know, really big in Facebook marketing, has a huge following, and maybe John has a great Facebook post that he wants to share with his Pinterest followers. Or maybe he's finding a way to grow his likes and he's trying to leverage the Pinterest community. Well, what you wanna be able to do is if you're trying to post individual Facebook business posts, you wanna be able to click on the date. So when you click on the date, a new page pops up and a new URL will show. And what you can do is you can use the power tool I'm gonna use pin for anything, click on it. And this is just a rough example, but grab that. And when I do, what's interesting is that I now have the option of choosing which board this pin goes to. I can change the description to anything that I like, and the link automatically links back to the unique URL of the Facebook post. So this is really important because if you link it directly to your main page and the post is rather old, let's say it's seven days later, and people click on it and they get redirected to your main page, they're probably gonna get a little bit confused. So you wanna make sure that you're using the post URL as much as possible. So once you click on that, you create a pin, and then it goes to the appropriate board that you've selected. And that's all there is to it. It's a wonderful tool, go check it out. And again, if you have any questions, you can go visit my site at www.mcngmarketing.com. I'll be happy to do my you know, I'll be happy to try to answer them the best I can. Again, thank you so much and happy pinning.